Today we're going to be comparing two nursery mail order companies. The first will be ConiferKingdom.com and the second will be KijiNursery.com. Let's start with Conifer Kingdom out of Oregon. Ordered a four to seven year old Bush's Lace tree and it arrived and it was actually 46 inches at all. Uh, came in a nice plastic bucket thing. Um, there it is. Nice and healthy. No brown on the needles and nice condition. The root ball was uh, nice and moist after coming all the way across the country from Oregon to Virginia. They shipped it on Monday. FedEx ground got here on a Saturday and very pleased. There it is, planted in the ground, watering it. Good job. Now let's go to Kiji Nursery. Ordered a weeping Froberg Norway spruce, nine years old, nine years worth of growth. And this, little, this came in a little bigger box, a little taller. This came from Washington State all the way to Virginia, sent the same way. FedEx ground, sent on a Monday, came in on a Saturday. And as I take the top off, we have a Christmas tree. No, it's actually a Froberg Weeping Norway Spruce. Um, yeah, so there it is. It had a few little brown spots on the needles. Is there's, there's a few right there you can see, but not bad, not bad at all for coming all the way across the country. And uh, the root ball, once again, was nice and moist. Now this one came in a little bag as, a, as opposed to a bucket, but that's okay. It's, root ball was intact and moist after six days of travel. So pleased with that. Um... So uh, I would recommend this company too. So don't hesitate. If you're thinking about, if you want a certain tree or a shrub and your local nursery doesn't have it and you can find it online, go ahead, order it online. There's the root ball for the Froberg. It too is, is really nice. And here's the Froberg planted in the ground. Looks good. Very successful internet purchases. No problems with either company. Would recommend both. So keep both in mind when you're doing your internet plant shopping. So after eight months, this is the way the Froberg is looking. Made it through the winter fine. Got a lot of new growth in April. Looking very lush. Nice dark green needles, none of them are dropping, and looking really good. Nice and healthy. And this is the way the bush's lace is looking after eight months. Once again, a lot of new growth, just like the Froberg. Looking really good and healthy. Alive and well. Now we just have to wait and see how these two trees do through the hot and humid summer. Hopefully if they can pull through that, they'll live a long, prosperous life.